going on, guys? Security Officer Smooley. Hope everybody had a good Christmas. And, uh, as you guys, as you guys know already, I uh, worked overnight last night, 1:30 to 6. Thank God. And I was here today at noon. And uh, it's pretty much uh, pretty quiet so far today, Sunday, day after Christmas. Bought me two of these bad boys. These, uh, Have you guys ever tried these? Ah, uh, shit, it's not too bad. Gets the job done. And you drinks don't work for me like they used to. Man. You know, they used to drink one and I'd be ready to go, ready to go. But you know, it's not. Uh, they don't get me as good as they used to. You know. But um. Today I actually wanted to talk about uh, 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 patrol logs. And uh, go over a couple of things as far as that. Let's see here. So every company, most companies, depending on the client, they require you to make a uh, a daily log or patrol log or daily or report. Every company might call it something different. But basically, most companies have something that you write down to track your progress throughout the day. Um, they're really sick. basically you want to make sure you uh, when you first get here. Here's some tips. You don't have to do this, but what I do is I write who I'm relieving, the name of the security officer I'm relieving, any equipment that I received from them, or if I'm the first person on shift, any uh, equipment that I received what I received and the condition that it's in and uh, that way you cover your ass you know your assets per se uh, if something was broken you don't want to be paying for it out of your pocket so just make sure you uh, document like for instance make sure there's no new dents scratches anything like that to prevent myself from having to pay out of my pocket you know so for instance uh, a, a while back we used to drive these uh, Crown Vicks, and uh, somebody wrecked one into there's yellow paint all over the place, and all these yellow con concrete barriers it had to be one of those. Nobody wants to fess up to it, so. Um, but be very careful because they will start taking money out of your paycheck depending on your company, depending on your state, and as long as it's not prohibited by law, they will take money out of your. Paycheck, so with that. But back to patrol logs. Um, I recommend checking in every 30 minutes. Some people check in every hour. It depends on the client again, but make sure you're doing the right thing that the client wants you to do. Um, basically, what I do is on one line, a simple report, a simple patrol log. Uh, I leave one note of where I'm, where I, where I am on the property at that time. So, for instance, I'm on the south side right now. And then I leave a quick note on the same line of what's going on over here. Maybe no suspicious activity, low vehicle traffic, high vehicle traffic, um, any kind of note about what's going on. And then if something does go down, I want to notate real quick. Uh, maybe received a call from such and such store and, and hyphen C incident report if there was an incident. Or another example, I uh, two native males, two intoxicated uh, native males. Um, I dealt with them and and just on one line really something really vague and then write in parentheses um, you know see incident report. Um, reports are really easy guys if you can't figure it out um, you can always send me a message I'll help you out they're not too hard man but if you want to look make yourself look good for the company make yourself look good in general I would say make sure that you um, you know try your best to be really descriptive use a lot of descriptive words especially in your report if there's an incident. Um, and again, I have a video on incident reports as well, so if you guys wanted to check that out, feel free to uh, check that out. And uh, if you guys didn't know who I was, again, I'm Officer Saru.